Hello my sweet friends and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I am so glad you stopped by to watch today's video. I'm Jamie and we're just going to spend the day together. I have a lot of things I want to do. I'm going to get organized. It's my day off and I use this day to kind of reset for the week ahead even though it's Tuesday. That's okay. I did a lot on Sunday just to get ready for the week but this is kind of like catch up on going through the mail, organizing, getting things on Facebook because I've been having so much fun, really getting rid of things that I don't need. And so you're just gonna spend the day with me. We're gonna cook some things. I'm gonna show you some recipes, some easy things that I do to get through my day and get through the week. But I am so glad you stopped by. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I have a lot of new subscribers and I am so excited for you guys to share, to enjoy, go along with my days. I love this platform. It has just given me such a great outlet just to do the things that I love and share with you all the things. It started out as my weight loss vlog and it's just continued just to living my healthiest life and living fully and it feels so stinking good. So if you guys are ready, let's spend the day together. So this is all I've done, you guys. I've sprayed my skillet with an olive oil spray. I've added my onions and my potatoes, and I'm just going to cook these through and just brown them up. As I've already allowed them to stick to the pan, I'm gonna add a little bit more olive oil spray. Turn down the heat a little bit. I try to do this on medium heat so I don't let it stick too much. In the meantime, I am going to go ahead and cook my two eggs. I like to do them over easy. So I just place them in my skillet. Might need to turn on the heat to help them cook. That would be a great idea. I'm really a crust, you guys know what I mean. I'm gonna add a little bit of water and cover them and I'm going to turn it down to medium heat and I'm going to set a timer for two minutes and I'm going to check every two minutes to see how they're doing. And as you can see, my pans that are supposed to be non-stick are not non-stick anymore. <laughs> Potatoes are almost done. So I will measure, I'll actually weigh these. We now have the onions and bell peppers in there. They kind of cook to nothing. So I'm gonna weigh and measure because I'm back on that. I'm trying, that's the only way that this girl can say it's consistent is weighing and measuring her food. I get a little obsessed with it and that's okay because sometimes life just happens and I have to do the things that are good for my soul and being accountable to myself and doing these things right is what I like. All right, so let's weigh and measure this stuff. All right, I'm also gonna show you where I track my food. So I use My Net Diary, love this app. It is phenomenal. It just keeps everything organized and I love how easy it is to use. All right, so I'm going to track my breakfast. So I'm gonna to go to breakfast and I'm going to search hash browns frozen. Okay, and then I'm going to go to grams because that's what we're going to do. So I'm going to turn my scale on and I'm going to measure. You guys, I love this. Love it. Love it. And I'm going to put in... I 
I'm gonna do 100 grams of potatoes. So it shows you how many carbs, how much protein, and how much fat, which I love. So I'm gonna track that. And then I'm going to add it to my bowl. So I've zeroed out my scale. And so now I'm just gonna measure. You guys, I didn't cook enough for the next day. That's hilarious. All right. You guys, I cooked just enough. That's hilarious. <laughs> All right, so that's about 204 grams of potatoes. That's a lot of potatoes, guys. All right, <laughs> but I'm just having, I'm not doing any extra protein. I am going to add my cheese. So I'm going to scan my cheese, all right? And I'm going to log this food. I'm going to do grams, and I'm gonna do probably 28 grams, which is 110 calories. Yep, that's what I'm doing. 110 calories, so I'm just going to add that to my bowl. I'm going to zero it out. And then I'm gonna add 28 grams. All right, perfect, 28 grams of shredded cheese. And that gives me six grams of protein as well, which is wonderful. So I'm gonna add that. And then I'm going to search my egg. So might need to clear that out, egg. So two large eggs is 143 calories. It's 12 grams of protein, nine grams of fat. So I'm gonna add that and then log it. And what I love about this app, you can go down and it's showing you how many grams of protein you're getting in, your total fat and total carbs. Love that about this app. So it's such an easy app to use. All right, so I've logged my breakfast. I am also drinking the coffee and I will be having a protein shake later on for snack. All right, so drinking all the coffee. I love my mug. Of course, getting my water in and going to eat the breakfast. So you guys, I did meet with my registered dietitian, Melissa. She is amazing and let me tell you something, she will do online virtual meetings with you guys. She's phenomenal, she knows what she's doing. One thing I love is we don't talk about my weight gain. We work on goals and we set the goals in place for what's to come and that's what I love about her. So we are only focusing, which I love, on my protein and my calories. Keeping it super simple so I don't have to be overwhelmed and it's working for me. I do have to say I am one week of fully tracking and it feels so stinking good. So I'm gonna eat the food. I did pretty good on the over easy eggs. But that's totally fine. Anyway, I'm gonna eat the food, and then we'll uh, we'll get to work today, guys. Me and you, you ready? Let's go. Let's do this. Mmm, so stinking good. Bon appetit. All right, friends. I am cleaning out this cabinet. You guys, it already looks so good. So I just wanted to clean out and kind of organize. I have all this stuff for. Thanksgiving and Christmas and Valentine's and I just wanted to organize everything and go through it and just keep it neat and tidy. So look hey guys, I had to show you how beautiful this looks. So clean, so tidy. I even cleaned up my three-tiered I even cleaned up my three-tiered tray. Simple. So much better and cleaned out all three of my drawers. This one's hard to get open, but you guys so organized. I am so excited, I cannot stand it. But, got that trash, got Tina going, she's gonna get caught, hold on. You guys, I really wish, it's so yellow in here, sorry. I really wish I could tell you this is some wet hair, but it's wet. Okay, I've been working so hard and it's felt so, I look like a pumpkin. Why is the lighting so off in here, you guys? Anyway, I'm gonna get to drying my hair. You guys will see the difference. None look like hot mess express because I have to look 
you know. All right, friends, I'm doing the easiest crock pot recipe ever. Okay, so all I'm doing is adding a pre-seasoned pork tenderloin to my crock pot with some diced seasoning blend onions and a little bit of water. Like I said, keep things as simple as you can to make your life easy. That's what it's all about, guys. Keeping things simple. I gotta get into this bad boy. So I'm just going to place that pork tenderloin in the crock pot. And it's got enough juices in there that I think it will be fine just adding like a cup of water. I thought I had carrots. I was so excited, but I don't. So we're just keeping things simple. So about a half a cup to a cup of onion blend. And then about a cup of water. And I'm just gonna slow cook this on high for four hours. And done. I just wanted to give you a really quick tour of my file decor at home, you guys. This is all I did. <laughs> I just did my mantle because you guys, we're here during the week. I didn't want to decorate fully and I might add some more. You guys might have just motivated me, but that's it, friends. Sometimes less is more. And I did add a little bit to this. So I made the little tassel ghost last year. Love them in the little tassel garland. Added a few little pumpkins. Like I said, keeping decorations like super simple. And let me show you what I did in the kitchen. Okay, so all I did, add Mr. Ghost, a little pumpkin, a pumpkin plate, the little towel. Like I said, super simple. My coffee cup with little, little centerpiece. All I did was add the orange pom poms and three little pumpkins and my boo picture, my boo pillow. Not a picture, it would be a pillow. So there you have it. And sometimes plans change and you decide to have pizza. This is from Marco's and it is car cauliflower crust. You guys, look at that goodness. Yes, please. I have changed for the 87th time. But my friends, that is a wrap of today's hang out with me video, spend the day with me, vlog, whatever you wanna call it. I love you guys so stinking much. Thanks for watching. Always remember, you're amazing, you're beautiful, you're loved, you're enough, and you're flipping phenomenal.